Hello and welcome to season two, episode twelve. Am I right? Twelve um, of Sounds Once Upon a Time in the Old World. Um, I am Guilds Ma- uh, Guilds Master Games Master Jim. What are uh, those? And tonight we are possibly facing the end of season two, uh, but it all depends how it goes. So yeah, I'm. Uh, the guild uh, can't get him here. It's going to be a great session tonight, isn't it? <laughs> I am the games master, and these are my group of blooded and bruised, battered, <laughs> um, nerd wells. I think that would offence of that, frankly. That um, I think he's putting it nicely. <laughs> <laughs> well, some of you definitely. Uh, hi, I'm Roger, and I'm playing Johan von Erfinder, the human engineer. And I can't remember if or what I spend my XP on. So, hey everybody, I'm Aaron, and I'm playing Hagen Ritter von Delburst, the human knight of the Order of the White Wolf. And I had been saving XP for a few sessions in hopes of, you know, maybe doing some between season endeavors or a career move, but. Uh, but at the end of the day, I realized I had to get to season three first. So I spent all my saved XP on melee, two-handed, and weapon skills. So Hagen would have a better chance of hitting and hitting a little harder. Excuse me, it's been a while. <coughs> hey, oh, by gum. It'd be me. More deck. The best Tauri accent on the internet. <laughs> no. <laughs> And uh, I, I ain't be expending any XP at the moment. Hi, I'm Colin. I'm playing Carolyn Redmacher, the human warrior priest of Ulrich. And I spent all of my XP last session on melee parrying in the hopes that I can survive to the end of the session. Well, good evening all. Uh, your elven diplomat, Ilmar, in here. Um, and he is, an, he is a diplomat. He's not a swordsmaster, despite his apparent talent for it. Sure. Um, uh, like everybody else, sensing a theme that this could be the end, I've put the last of my XP into being able to dodge better, because apparently that's what I'm really good at. So, <laughs> these guys like to parry. I just like to not get hit. <laughs> much of a much in the same, same principle. Is that everybody? That's everybody. God, that, that went quickly tonight. <laughs> so, to bring everybody up onto uh, a decent level, um, the party had found out where the Ebon Blade were keeping the remains of um, Artur, and uh, with the help of some underhand people, uh, they found a way in through the cellar uh, of the pub. Can everybody remember the name of the inn? I'm looking at Aaron because he always writes this stuff down. <laughs> I can see him I flicking through his notes right now. Saw something. Oh, uh, da, 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 da. Hold on. <laughs> so many pages back now. That's not far uh, off, actually, Colin. That's not far off at all. Got nope. nothing. Okay. Um, yeah, so it was called the Bright Sun. Um, and they made their way through the cellar, up the stairs. Ilmarin tripped up, pushed the door through. Yeah, it all went mad. There was a lot of shouting, a lot uh, of... Uh, <clears throat> I'll have you know, Ilmarin tried to do his best to save the situation and then someone fired a gun into it. <laughs> and I knew that could have been. Yeah. Ilmarin had almost convinced them that he needed to go outside and deal with it, uh, and then someone shot them. <laughs> also, before we start, you know, I, it I am going to apologize. I am going to apologize tonight if there is anything going wrong with the computer. My computer is on its very last legs and is doing all manner of strange shit in front of my face. Uh, but we'll try and get this through this as smooth as possible even if i have to use dice and paper we'll we'll we will get through this battle tonight uh we've had a couple of weeks uh in the past just gone that we've been away 
um, through various people being ill with COVID and other things as well. Um, so, yeah, I mean, uh, we don't really want to put this off anymore. We don't want to put the death of the party off anymore. So. Um, need to put a firing uh, Yeah, I will, I will be speaking in a very solemn voice this evening as, uh, <laughs> as I, I put the rest of the party to the sword. <laughs> Honest. We'd just been betrayed by the old guard captain as well, didn't we? Oh, yeah, yeah that yeah. was oh, your match your fist. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yep. oh, oh, stabbed more than I mean, literally stabbed face. someone in the back. Literally stabbed me in the back. Or oh, the back of the leg, yeah. wasn't it? Yeah. Back yeah. Of yeah. Leg. Back I of mean, leg. it's still the back. <laughs> it's still the um, back. <laughs> and literally got stabbed in the back. Friend of, friend of the party, an all round nice girl, uh, in Grader Muller, um, has just. Um, I don't know what you'd Declared say. Declared uh, herself for the enemy and attacked us. Come, come out of the black closet and... Um, black closet? Um, <laughs> That's where the evil ones sit. You know, it's it's a sad testament when you can trust the word of a chaos knight to Nurgle more than you can t- trust the word of a guard captain of Middenheim. I'm just saying. Sad. Sad state of affairs. Okay. We're, all, we're all the wrong team. <laughs> so, it's... There was we had a couple of rounds of combat. I believe that one of the uh, Kessler brothers is down. Um, mm-hmm. Thomas holding his stomach. Is he dead? Is he alive? We don't know. Um, I've got Ingrid a pretty Arthur nasty just pulled out A rather large sword and stuck it into the leg of Mordek. Um, Rolf is being his normally large self in front. Um, and we've got um, the rest of the party. All well and good, I believe. I think everybody's in a fairly good state, aren't they? Not really, no. <laughs> um, Imaran's absolutely fine at this moment in time. I don't know how long that's going to last for. He's been it's, dancing it's only Hagen and Mordek who've been brutally savaged um, and okay. are, you know, one hit away from dead. But yeah, yeah. That's the rest fair. of us are... Oh, no. Probably only also one hit away from dead because they're hitting really terrifyingly hard. Indeed, 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 indeed. So, just a quick one before we start and jump into combat. Worst case scenario, I'm an elf. I run really fast. <laughs> Worst case scenario, I ha- I still have four fate points. So, jump uh, then. Sorry, just dealing with the child halfway through the game. Um, Seems Dan, all right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Have you been getting any sleep, Dan? None. <laughs> like, I'm lucky if I get a two-hour block at the moment. Oh, man. I... <laughs> so I need to go through, before we start properly, I need to go through everybody's... Um... So I've got... Hagen at 46. Your initiative, yeah? Uh, I think that's right. Hold on, let me check. Could you try again? Oh, sorry. Bro. Yes. Um, Elmar is at 47. That's correct. Okay. No. No. Uh, where are we? Where are we? Where are we? I think we'd got back to the top of combat, hadn't we? Yep, top of the round. We had indeed. We had indeed. Johan, I, I believe it's it's probably Ilmar and Hagen, Johan, all the bad guys, Cavalin Mordek. Because <laughs> we have shit in it. That sounds right to me too, yes. That's normally the way it plays out. Is those? Things I have, agree. <laughs> sometimes there's some either side of Johan. It, 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 the only question is whether Johan's going ahead of all of the NPCs or not. Uh, my initiative is, is 42. Whether... Oh dear. And okay. Ben has just given uh, Jim, myself, and Aaron rerolls. And Josh <laughs> gave me Josh gave me one. Josh gave me one earlier, so I'm up to two now. So oh, and Dan, I'm not sure which Dan, but one of the Dans has a reroll. <laughs> More decks injured. Let's give it to him. <laughs> oh, no, oh, not that injured. Honest. Uh, Ilmarin's definitely got one, and Colin's okay. got one. Oh, and uh, so one one Dan has got two. Other Dan's got one. Everyone else has got one. Apart yeah, from Hagen, sorry, who has to. So the dwarf, I'm feeling the love. I'm feeling the, dwarf, the love here. Yeah. Dwarf, the dwarf and uh, Hagen have both got two. 
No, no. Elf and Hagen have got two. Elf have got Hagen. I've got one. Oh, I've got two. So, as the round finishes off, the front door opens. Just what we need. Even more chaos. And just inside, the, they just come inside. There's not a charge or anything, but inside the door come two elven bowmen in black tabards. Oh, crap, that's And it. a rather nicely dressed elven lady. Um, Dan, make me a perception roll. <laughs> yeah, I got a feeling. I feel like I'm going to recognise this person. Knew it. Oh, Jim's got an extra reroll. Oh, oh, sorry, I've got my, I've got my, I've got my combat stuff still active. Whoever's get, I can't get onto Twitch because my computer. But whoever's given me that, thank you very much. If if my players could keep a tally of my rerolls, sure. it's Ben. Like you've got to. Of, I'll keep a tally of yours and mine, Jim. Thank I'll keep a tally of yours, Jim. Zero. <laughs> <laughs> so I've got to reroll this because I've got my combat advantage then. Then. I've Did got you get your? To, uh, I know your uh, combat to, advantage sure. is still there, Dan. The combat. Oh, okay, it's, yeah. okay. Then in which case, I pass with three success levels. Yeah, it's the very, very, very lovely, and you have happened to have had a very, very soft spot for her. Not anymore, uh, I don't. Back in the- <laughs> right, uh, Lady no, Alabania. Yeah, yeah, I remember her. She she offered me help. Dirty traitor. You you know how her husband was the one who let Magleth out and died in the process? Yes. Did you not cotton onto that? No, it's fine. No, he They're was too stupid. He let him out. If, no, if no, you remember, Ilmarin told us that, that elves that wear black are bad guys. Well, no, I no, I no longer believe it was an accident. I, uh, it, was an, it was pretty obviously not an accident at the time. The halfling was strung up over the... Nah, I, I didn't believe that an elf could do such terrible, terrible things. I was naive to the world. Yep. Okay. Now, the two elves seem quite slow, but this elven lady does seem very swift of motion and uh, thing, and she pulls back her bow and she fires. Now, again, I can't roll, I can't type anything down on my computer, so it's very much click and point. So could somebody roll me a D6 roll and take away, let me get this right first, and take away the six. So if you get a six, roll me another one. I just rolled a D5. <laughs> oh, okay, even better. Okay. So, yeah, she lets an arrow I loose. I thought it... we might have stood a chance maybe of pulling this through, but now I think we're toast. It'll be a glorious death. Adding it an extra three ancestors. enemies to the fight is just going to tip it. There is... It looses straight over the front line and... Going to war deck, please. <laughs> You're on the front line, Mordek. Uh, yes, I am, sir. Yes. Oh, yeah, as the three of us are on the front line, I, don't, I just still don't know why an elven diplomat's on the front line. Oh, my goodness. Um, oh, sweet God. Um, into the body of oh. Carolyn. <gasps> I'm taking a defence roll. Uh, you can't. I have a shield. Oh, you do? Yeah, melee basic. I have a shield. Ah, nice. I can melee. I can apparently. I could. I'm not going to be able to beat success levels ten. But you might be able to reduce some damage. But I might not die. I will actually. Can can we frame that roll of one? Yeah, for me. Yeah, I don't think I've managed to roll a one for the whole. Right. The, the one. Anything. The one time he decides to roll well is when we're in mortal yeah. peril. Yeah, yeah. Well, we, yeah. as I said, we are we are basically dead at this point. So. Oh, oh yeah, we're screwed. <laughs> So, whatever. I believe. <laughs> oh. uh, you have got I'm a reroll. You got that. a reroll. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I think I'll take my reroll on that. <laughs> Rather than adding four more damage. <laughs> Rather than adding, adding, two, uh, adding two more damage. Oh, no, success was minus, minus four. four. Yeah, yeah, you're right. You're right. There you go. You uh, reduced it by two. Uh, it should be more than that because it's a defensive weapon that's not been factored in. So you get plus one success level, don't you? So it's plus three. Total. So it's plus three. So it reduces the damage to 17. 17. So it reduces the damage to 17, 
Which... Could someone please roll me a well, d4, please? Eliminate that. And put me... Now I need to find my things. Body. Uh, total is... Six, nine... I take eight wounds. Could you take a further three, three from the coldness that comes from the arrow? Please? Yeah, sure. <sighs> right, fine. That leaves me on two wounds. Oh, three. I think. I got Clean biscuits. One. No, three wounds. It might matter, but no. To me, that means you're still in it. <laughs> oh, I'm still fighting, but uh, I'm. Uh, I can't see at the moment any way that we could possibly survive this. Okay, we've got to, we've got to close can. with the archer. Yeah. Yeah. Well, we we've got three is this? three oh, equally oh, dangerous oh, enemies oh, in with us. And, with yeah. you, not me. <laughs> no, we've only got two enemies in front of us right now. We're actually outnumbering them. No, you, well, no, you've well, got. There were three no. guardsmen plus Ingrader plus the three elves that have just come in. Never, ever, ever, ever <laughs> doubt my my NPCs for having more than just kicking your head in in the ropes. <laughs> right. Okay. So she was at the top. Yeah. It goes to Ilmarin. Fine. Ilmarin, what would you like to do? There okay. is a large Kessler man in front of you. There's two guards. Yeah. Um, and you have heard a scream from Mordek. You've sort of turned around. And now it looks like him and Engrader are in the dance of battle. I just struck at Engrader as well. Yes. And I, Remember, I'm guessing... we can we can if you've got advantage, you can you can reduce your advantage to zero to disengage without getting attacked, and you could charge the elf bow people. Yeah, I'm not sure I'll do very well against a bunch of elf warriors um, yeah. without my advantage. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm in a, I'm in a predicament at the moment because I want to close the archers down because they're going to do some serious harm to us, um, and I'm guessing I can't. I'm I'm too into the thick of combat to actually just get away. Um, you can, well, you can disengage if you spend your advantage to disengage, and they can't yeah, attack you. But I don't. Want, I don't want to do that. Like I said, I yeah. just uh, the, there'll be Elven warriors, and I struggled against the last Elven warrior. <laughs> just um, and then my friend Mordek is also in trouble. Well, oh, this is a conundrum. I think we most of us are now severely wounded. Um, yep. Yeah. Oh man. So I don't spend my thing to dis disengage. They're just going to shoot me and take my advantage anyway. Yeah, I'll have to spend my... <clears throat> I'm going to use my advantage, and I'm going to dance through the combat and launch myself at the elven archers to try and hold them back. You get charged, yep. Yeah, you get charged, yep. Yeah, so that's what I'm going to do, Jim. I've spent my advantage to break from the current combat. Yep. So kind of like twirling through with my sword and deflecting some shots as he goes through, and then he charges into all three archers just to try and slow them down because they obviously haven't got melee weapons drawn at the moment, so I'm going to try and cause them some trouble and they won't be able to shoot if they're in combat with me. So that's what I'm going to do, and I'll give myself one advantage back. And I'm going to strike at her because she's a traitor. She stood behind the two warriors. Okay, then I'm going to attack the two warriors but get her somehow tied into the combat as well. Right. There we go. Let's do some... Uh, Come on. You beautiful elven sword master. Oh, no, oh. no, no. Let's just see what they roll and then I'll uh, see what he rolls and then I'll um, see if I need to re-roll. One point. One point off. <laughs> oh, come on. Where are we? Uh, characters. I mean, even if I fail, I've at least tied up the archers. Well, Hagen's going to do the exact same thing because those oh. archers will kill us. Well, if I've got them you've tied also up... Got the, you've also got the... Still very much up and fighting guards, you know, dang dangerous guardsman. If you step out of the way of him, I'm fine. I won. Uh, so you do 11 damage. 11 damage. 11 damage. I, am I am actually going to re roll that. <sighs> oh, okay. Don't do this to me, Jim. <laughs> Who gave him a re roll? Remind me to. That was Ben. <laughs> Fuck you, Ben. Fuck you, Ben. <laughs> Fuck well, you, hey. Ben. <laughs> you, you've okay. got to re so, two so re rolls. I have to use mine now. Who says that this is <laughs> and still wins? Who, who says this isn't for the better of the uh, group? Uh, okay, I win. 
Get That's out. Eight damage then. <laughs> How much damage? Just the eight. I'm I'm not well equipped for fighting. <laughs> Uh, I've at least tied up the archers now. Okay, you strike at one of them, you've injured one of them. Okay, uh, Hagen. Okay, so, Dan, you sure you want me to leave you there by yourself? Look, number three you, to one. Yeah, okay. uh, yeah, and you're also outnumbered for two to one at the moment. That's true. Okay, <laughs> you so uh, you've got you've got three. We've got three guards plus Ingrader. Yeah, at the back, and I'm also guessing that those Johan's are... going to let out some big bang shots in a minute. So, uh, out. so yeah, Johan. Uh, Don't I mean, forget uh, Hagen. Yeah, well, Hagen's going to swing at, at Rolf, the guy or who, uh, the big guy in front of him. Okay. Yeah. Uh, all right, please, please, Ulrich. Let's 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 do let's start this right. Yes. <laughs> nice Every oh. yeah, that'll do it. Ouch. <laughs> that was an eleven. For uh... oh, we're all dead. We're all gonna die. Yeah. Oh, oh I told you so. Uh, yes. Right. <laughs> I think most of us well, are one hit off going down. Certainly, at least three my of NPCs us are. have been one hit of going down all way, all through two seasons of playing. So <laughs> it has been pretty dull in the last few sessions. <laughs> oh my goodness! Come on, don't be a dickhead. Well, let's get rid of. That's what? just. That's just. What? That's you just. One hundred and one oh, with no advantage. <laughs> it. Uh, there's no what? advantage. No, but he has got. He has got some pluses. Uh, it's a defensive I... weapon, which gives him plus one success level. Jesus. But I. Uh, hey guys, I can't. I can't hit him. Yeah. The critical still goes through, though, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah the critical the crit goes does. through, but but I can't hit him, so. Ruptured ligament. Immediately drop whatever held in your hand. Oh, that's actually and massive because he has to drop his halberd. Yeah, he can't that's use his halberd. handy. Unless he, he takes, unless he he takes take... it on the armour. Um, he is, in fact, going to burn a fight point. Okay. Oh. Poopy. Almost as if this is the last battle or something. It is for sure the last battle. <laughs> it's definitely <laughs> our last battle. And just when you think Hammerzoit is is bit in, his weapon sort of flips around and it sort of grabs a little bite on the hammer, and it, it looks like it's saved him. Looks like some big dark hand has moved your armor just slightly away. <laughs> All right. I should have charged. I can't hit this guy at all, guys. We're we need to run. So right, Johan's gonna shoot him. Okay. So where are we now? That is over two. Um ye I've got a wrong there, but what is what what's your um he acts the same time as you, Johan? So you can go first. Okay, uh, yeah, I'm going to shoot him. In fact, yeah, okay. Go for it. Ouch. Hmm. I'm tempted to re-roll that, because that's quite bad damage. Yeah, but you don't want to roll it into a fail. That's true. I'm going to use a... Boom. Ah, no, I'm not going to use a fortune point. I'll just take it. Okay. He's got to do a bravery test, isn't he, for the black powder side of things? He does have to do a cool test. No, they don't. We've already established this. You, you, yep. Oh, yeah. We we oh, yeah. had that last session. However, right. he doesn't have his advantage anymore. This That's true. true. 
And it's penetrating as well, so it goes... It ignores any leather armour, sorry, any non-metal armour and one point of other armour. Okay, uh, where are we? We could really do with a metal mage right now, couldn't we? Two points. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Kevin. <laughs> Two. Okay. Right. Rolf goes. And he is going to. Roll bad, roll bad, roll bad, roll bad. Stick his halbard right where the sun don't shine. Of Hagen. Fucking hell! Oh, oh. oh. That Hagen, was good. That Hagen was good. wins just. <laughs> nice one, <Roger. laughs> nice one. <laughs> that is unreal, man. <laughs> I don't know about you guys, but I'm really sweating. <laughs> Me too, Jesus. This is, this is absolutely <laughs> edge of. Oh wow! <laughs> How did you do that? Roll a five to my six. Jeez. That's unreal. That is amazing, oh, man. man. Oh. Okay. So it's now in graders go. Oh, no. Uh, where are we? We're now relying on Dowie Constitution right now. Yeah. My, I, I'm all, well, my wounds aren't as bad, but I have taken a big chunk, so. Uh... Who's she going to go for? Mordek. She's got both well, Mordek and Carolyn on her. Yeah, she's going for Mordek. Oh, come on, don't be a dick now. Okay. <laughs> That's not very nice. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. come on, Mordek. Um, I'm going to re-roll that. Then you want to see what Mordek rolls first? No. Oh. Uh, <laughs> okay. You now have zero rerolls um, no by my tracking. Not much better. We believe in you, Mordek. Come on, Mordek. I don't have any advantages at the moment. Uh, parry. She's try she's basically not trying to hit you as much this time. But, but it, it roll is normal, but she's Maybe they want to take alive. Can he spend a thingy point to make that plus no, one? He'd still lose. Oh would he? Oh, okay. Yeah. It's in the event okay. of a tie, it's whoever's got a higher base stat. You have got just so been given two more re rolls, Dan. I'm gonna do well that puts me on three then, right? Um so I'm gonna do a re roll. Okay. Yeah, but if you roll, come on, come on. Or oh, oh, you could just take the hit. And try how and about save. how much damage would it be with the hit? Eleven. Eleven. No. Oh, I could. Oh yeah, yeah, it's, got, yeah it's eleven. It's got plus two. Minus your toughness and armor. Yeah, I could actually take that. I think you could actually spend a fortune point to knock it down to ten. Fate. Fortune. One of them. I. Could... Okay. Because Although if you, you get the extra success one at least. level. You could reduce. You, you'd still have one extra success level, so the base damage coming in would be ten. You would always take one. So if you, <coughs> so if well, your armor eleven was, minus Mordex soaken armor might not might still be much. one. Three. I don't know what your soaken armor is. What's the soak? What have you got on your seven, body, Mordex? Ten. I've got ten in total. Yeah, so it makes yeah. no difference. So you'd only you just take, take one, one point. I'm alright with that. Okay. But it does mean she gets okay, an advantage. So you don't take any damage. Is she sort of she hitting to stand? Goes to hit you. It's through on you, and she sort of puts her sword into the floor, and as a part of a, a move, really moves round to the other side, and she's making a break for the doorway. <laughs> okay, but is it back to me now? No, no, no. So she's like, like I said, it's sort of a dance thing. So she's. 
yeah, she, she she's not going to back to you, but she's like on the other side and she's moving towards the doorway. She's kind of, of just pivoted around there, him. Yeah, I'm still going to try and fuck her up. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Bit blunt. Yeah. Uh, well, at least she's <laughs> spent her advantage to disengage from you. Yeah. Okay. Um, and she didn't hit you as well. I say, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm put the back on. Okay. A fair man, yeah, a fair man. Right. <laughs> sure. Um, <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> okay, so the guards now pile in. So there's now Carolyn. Yeah. Johan. Carolyn, Johan and Mordek. And Hagen. 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 I'm stood kind of behind Hagen, yeah. like a hero. So it's, Car- actually it's Carolyn, Mordek, and Hagen. So yeah. could one of you roll two D3s for me, please? Go for it, Roger. Are you all me too? Okay. Yeah. One, two, three. One, two, three. <laughs> oh, okay. Three. That's the first one. And... Uh, so the guard going for? number one and number two both get one. Okay, that's oh, right, Carolyn that's... and Hagen. Yep. yep. Okay. I thought that was Mordek and. <laughs> yeah, because I rolled actual D3s rather than D6. And okay, so the first one. I wouldn't mind these two that much. So oh, two. right. You rolled 2D3 and got three. I, uh, yeah, sure. Yeah. Cool. Okay. All right, Carolyn, you got this. Maybe, I believe. I've got a ton of um, fortune or fate points, or whichever one it is, the one you can spend more freely. So, so know. the first one is fortune. the one on Carolyn. The second one is on Hagen. Yeah. So Carolyn, Hagen. <laughs> <laughs> you got those that, reruns. That's more like the Jim we know. Keep it up, Jim. I'll. I'll <laughs> I'm right, you've, got a lo- you've got a lot of rerolls. I'm, I'm just saying, I'm just going to, I'm just going to use a fortune point to reroll that because 94 is not acceptable. Oh, oh for fuck's sake! <laughs> Jesus! Uh, oh, that's hilarious. So you, that's actually minus three, isn't it? Because your shield is defensive, right? No, yep, yep. No, I think I still need to succeed to get a bonus success. Level, yeah. Don't I? I need to get positive success levels to get a bit, to get plus one on them. I think. No, it just Doesn't if you're so. wielding such a weapon, gain okay. a bonus of plus one SL when you're to so any melee test when you're posing. That would be in. minus three, <sighs> which would be eleven damage to the body, which is probably right enough arm. to drop me anyway. Wait, which one? Uh, right arm. Well, whichever. Right arm. I don't think it makes actually any difference, but you cannot spend. You can burn either fate point. Which is a permanent one Four, to how did six, that miss? Nine. Or burn a resilience point, which is again another permanent one, but you can choose the number you've rolled. Uh, nine. So you've got to choose eight, an 11. 11 and crit him. I don't think I can with a shield. You can, No, no. You do. Because it's undamaging? When... Nope. Because <laughs> you're also defending with a axe or something. So you can roll an 11 and just do a crit. If you burn, I know you don't automatically inflict one wound with an undamaging weapon. Not you can't crit, so I could still crit with it. Or I could take the two wounds that are going to get through my soak and be on one wound left. Also an option. I think I'll probably do that because I really don't think that's going to make the 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 kind of damage being thrown around in this. That level of damage <laughs> is <sighs> unlikely to make enough difference. I'll okay. Take, I'll take the. I'll use the wounds on the, that rare occasion that it's going to matter. Okay. Hagen, would you like to roll against my massive roll? Yeah, I got plus five success levels yeah, to your like minus. Yeah. Hey, minus five advantage. and a fumble. Yeah, you, yeah, you, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's uh, uh, your weapon oh, suffers one damage, last. and you go last on initiative. Oh, okay, fine. Oh wow, someone's going to go after me. For the guy. <laughs> That, that, that okay. So the two owls have dropped to their bows and drew swords. That takes their action, though, right? Yes, it does. Cool. 
Well, not... it, it, it does theirs anyway. Yeah. Um, Carolyn. Awesome. Um, so you've got one of these Elvedeers on you at the moment. I'm going to wail on him. Okay. I, I can't re easily... I don't think I can easily get to Ingrida, so... I'm just going to have to go with trying to take out some one of the goons. So you've got a reroll. Got a re you, yeah. You've got yeah. several rerolls. Have I have I been given any more rerolls on Twitch? Uh, you, you don't need to do on one reroll on per thing. No, don't forget. So, I, know. Yeah. I know. I'm just asking. Have I got any more rerolls on uh, Twitch? Yeah, you've so, yeah, given you've got a lot of rerolls. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I, think. I have. I've used. I've used one. That I've been given so far, that I was tracking. If you've had a look at their role, you have got yep. through. Yeah, yeah. So that is five plus two seven. for that. Seven plus two, because it's not taken into account my strike mighty blow, nine. So nine damage, yeah? <clears throat> yep. Okay. And an advantage! <laughs> I'm finally got right? an advantage. See? Yeah. <laughs> I'm even wearing elves tonight, you see, so on, on the proviso that I would do well. <laughs> okay. <laughs> More deck. Available on the Can Black I... Red Bubble. This one, this one, <laughs> see how I Can I... Am I able to hit um, Treacherous Captain... Yeah, you Justin can go Captain for it. For where I am. Yeah, absolutely. I... You'd need I... to move up to her. Charge. She's no, you can't. They're not not, not charge this. <laughs> He's a dwarf. Yeah, He's really will small. That, will, that, will that be? Will that be inviting an attack of opportunity by the others? Uh, no, no, I'm not. In which do. case, I'm going to go for it. No one else is actually attacking you at the moment. Then she needs to die. Mm. Uh, a lot oh, of these no, assholes no. need to die, unfortunately. I just want to see one of these guys. One of these people fall. Well, we've taken down one of them. Yeah. Well, yeah, I mean, one of the main ones. <laughs> At this point, one of the three. Ooh, um, oh, Mordek! So, so I'll be re that. Extra re -rolls. I think you've got three re-rolls, Dan. I yeah, got yeah. two, because I spent one in the... <sighs> Tell you that, Roger. parry. Um, <laughs> wow. Yeah. Out. Oh, that's awful. Our dice have absolutely deserted us. No. Try again. More Mordek. Yeah! Yes. It's a bit better. Uh, so nine damage. He gets plus one for his special oh, axe as well. Ten. And and if I may, I'm also dual wielding, oh, so it flips. The oh, it flips to, to a, a to a twelve. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> That's for the hand weapon for the same amount of damage. There's a lot Which of so damage. Damage. Go in there. So two bouts of 10 damage. Two whacks of 10 damage, which is going to be one on one, let's face it, but still. And you gain an advantage because you hit with both. Yay! Also, uh, is your character about to dye his hair orange um, and shave his <laughs> no. beard? Because he's now dual wielding. <laughs> very Slayer-esque. So, the, back to the top again. Um, Did she take any Alvin damage, sorry? Oh, yeah, you look like oh, you good. drew a little bit good, of blood. Good, good. Yeah. Oh, yeah, she would have up. taken one damage from each of those blows. Yeah, um, but still, it's the point that counts. <laughs> the elven woman, who's dressed very nicely and looks very sort of uh, noble, shouts something out. Can anybody speak elven? Of course. I can. <laughs> okay. I speak Elitharian. She yeah, calls Rod, out. Rod, Roger somehow, from listening to one conversation, has learned the entire <laughs> elven language. <laughs> I don't he thought you were teaching skills. him the basics, but he's a linguist. <laughs> I don't care about your skills. No human has ever mastered Elven. I'm sure his pronunciation is still shit. Oh, yeah, he probably sounds like a proper country bumpkin, doesn't he? <laughs> anyway, what does she shout while I'm raging at Roger's character learning Elitharian? <laughs> she shouts, um, Griselda, Rolf, the, car the carter waits. There's a cart. They're cheating it. We've got them on the ropes. <laughs> that's, that's, <laughs> I, I certainly fires, admire your optimism. Of the he fires an arrow at Mordek. <laughs> <laughs> that, it makes sense because of the fact she's had a go at her. 
Ah oui. Please, Santa, can you fix my computer? <laughs> um, all right, there we go. Uh, I'll piss off with you. Where are we? Where are we? Where are we? And he... No, no, no. No, well, there you go. There we go. There we go. Ah, uh, right. Let's try that again. Come back. Oh, right. Don't be a dickhead. There we go. There we go. Oh. oh, but still, you're tough. You got armor on your body. Yeah. Might not be too I, bad. Can I try and dodge? No. No. Uh, I can't block my shield or anything either because I haven't got no, one you, anymore. No, you're dual wielding. So, um, don't, how much is that going to do me for? You said your sight was 10, right? So yeah. three. It is at the moment. Yeah, three. three. Right. Can, you, can someone roll me a D4, please? Oh, oh my God, not again. Three. Oh, oh, oh thanks. So six points. Six. That knocked me down. Okay. Is that, is that, is that uh, Mordek? Oh, no, no. I had eight, so, okay. yeah. <laughs> still still raging. Yeah, yeah, still there. You're just getting angrier. And Delmarin, you can say she's sort of backing off the two the two elves have now blocked uh the, the way sort of thing so you've got two elves in front of you will morrow i do um, right I do, but is it my turn now um no oh but it is now oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so, <laughs> when you say she's backing away like how far she backed away like is she like really far or if i wave my sword no, between no, no, the two no, no. of them yeah, she, i could clip she, her yeah yeah, she she can. Yeah, she she's. It's like um. She's keeping a distance, but without keeping a distance, if that makes any sense. Okay, so I'm like probably fighting these two, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to actually wedge myself between the two of them and attack her. Right. If she's close enough to do that. Probably not. You can. You. you it'd probably mean them having two uh, attacks of opportunity on you. So can to speak. I? Can I dodge those attacks of opportunity, or do I lose my ability to dodge? No, you won't be able to dodge them. Your whole your whole thing will be getting through to her. Okay. When well, in which case, I'm going to once again expend my advantage, and I'm just going to break away and attack her. I okay. Really, I did really didn't want to be losing my advantage for a second time, but here we go. So you can break away backwards, but, but not they through. Blocked the way. No. So, so I, I can't. Through. You can't you can't ignore the the people who are standing in your way. <laughs> I was I was kind of hoping like, I could like flip to the side, bounce off the bar, and then go over. The Not top. this again. What happened last time you tried to do the hat? Yeah, I know exactly. I'm... <laughs> I believe I believe that Mordek wore you as a hat. Didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> no, if it works well, he'll end up lying on top of her, right? You know, worst case scenario, I just fall on top of three elves, <laughs> yeah, right? You can you can try that if you want. I'll I'll give you a roll of tip. <laughs> yeah, right. Got it. I'm gonna go for it. What's good way? Okay. Acrobatics, right? Um, okay, so I don't, I, I don't, not uh, athletic. athletics. athletics. Here we go. So, what like... I want you to do is make a very hard, <laughs> of course, you're gonna make it very ball. hard. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna re roll it. I'm gonna re roll it. We can do okay. this. <laughs> oh dear, it was worth a go. Yes! Oh! Yes! <laughs> yes! Okay. So, Ilmarin. So you do land on the other side, but they will be able to attack you. Ah, oh, <laughs> Well, I'm gonna. Do I get to attack her first though before they get to swing at me? They they'll swing at you first as you leave their um, vicinity. But I spend my advantage to disengage. You didn't just disengage. You did this mad 
Like I looked flipped. amazing, Jim. I flipped did, off a bar. It did, it did go slow motion, and it did keep but going. Back technically, then, Dan, you still got your advantage. Do, ah, go for it, yeah. Oh, if they get tax of advantage, I'm keeping my advantage. But I'm gonna lose it when they hit me, right? So go for it. Swing at me. Need to find them first. It's gonna. They're hurt. pretty if shit. It, so it, I won't worry about it. If it counts as bullet time. Because musket balls go slower than normal bullets do do nowadays. Does that mean the bullet time is even slower? Yeah, everything's slow. Everything just goes <laughs> slow. And you watch it from each angle as well, so it comes towards you underneath. Yeah, all that. Um, okay. Just have this like idea of he like bounces on a chair and flips off the bar and then lands behind the two guards and the guards go, "What are we doing?" and just whack me in the back. <laughs> But I still get to hit the cow. First one rolls. The second one. I mean, you say they're rubbish, but they're elves, so they're not going to be rubbish. Rolls. Did that ah! not? Come ah! oh, on, Dan. <laughs> uh, so I don't one get... hit. One hits. Yep. What's his um, damage? Does he get to defend? Um, do I get to defend or do I just... Or I can't no, dodge, but can I defend? No, because no, my, my, my full focus is on hitting this elven right. lady. So that's just straight through to your... Um, it's a... I'm sorry, it's not done the weapon because I can't get to the weapon. Um, so which is another, another, a normal handheld weapon. Plus so plus three. four. So plus seven, so ten. So, ten damage. Ten damage. Minus, minus my, toughness and armor. My, minus my toughness and so let me just go to my armor. Do, 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 do. I have a soak of seven, so I take three points of damage. Yes. But you do now lose all your advantage. Yeah, I know, but I was willing to lose it to do the flip and everything anyway, right? So she's not armed at the moment. She's got a bow out. So spend a fate point, make it an eleven, just crush her soul. I'll spend a resilience. I don't have resilience points. Oh, Elves don't have it. Right. Ooh. Okay. So you go to hit and she doesn't even move. As you get as the blade gets close to her, it stops and hits what? something. Now, whatever it is, it's like a fishbowl is around her. But you oh, cause the field. crack on the fishbowl. So you hit it, it stops you, but there's a large crack appears down like a, a magical sphere around her. Cool. Fucking pointy ear, Delvin magic. Yeah, <laughs> magical. Anyway, but the most important thing, she's not shooting my friends now with a magic bow. Pagan. So you've got right. one of the guards on you. And Rolf still, right? Yeah, well, Rolf. Who did Rolf attack? Hagen. Hagen he attacked yeah. me. Yeah, Rolf, yeah. Rolf, and, yeah. Rolf and the guard. All right. So uh, Hagen will once again try to hit Rolf. Where's Rolfy? Jesus, he's on the ball tonight, isn't he? Look at that. The hey, thing right. is that Rolf's Rolf is getting. Rolf. Plus eight, plus ten defense rolls. So. Yeah, I mean, he rolled a one last time. <laughs> yes, finally. 23 damage. <sighs> you could spend a fortune to make it 24. Now nah, I'll leave it. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, why not? That, it, so I'll spend a fortune point to make it 24 damage. Just remind me again, Colin, have I got any rerolls? No, you don't. <laughs> not that I've been told about. So I spent them trying to murder us. I've been. No. He, he I've hasn't. been just paying attention. I've just been tracking, like, what I've been so talking that's about. That's twenty-three damage. Yeah, uh, 24. twenty-four. I sp I spent a fortune point to make it an extra point of damage. Do it. <laughs> He's already uh, taken a gunshot. So, I mean, twenty-four damage has got to hurt. <laughs> so you you spent a fortune point for the extra damage. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, it does bite down, and he, he does let out a bit of a... Ah, but he's still there. Damn. <laughs> Damn. That blow, that blow 
would have killed Hagen if mean? Hagen was at full health. Oh yeah, that would have one shotted me. <laughs> mm. Right. Okay. Yeah. In Grader, she bursts through the door and she attacks you, Ilmarin. Right. Fine. <laughs> Oh dear. Uh, Come on, dice. Don't let me down now. At least you get the dodge this one. Okay. I'll let it, still going at it. Oh. I've got some have I got any rerolls left? Yeah. yeah. I've only used one, haven't I? Yep, you've got so two you've left. Got two more. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that was not what you wanted. No, it is what it is. Right, so that's fifteen damage. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. That's Elmarin's hurting now. And can someone roll me a D four, please? Oh. oh, damn it! Oh, they, these, this ain't the same as the arrow. Can someone stop um, Roger rolling these dice? <laughs> Curse you, Roger. So, oh, shit. your maximum hit points has now been reduced by four. What? Yeah, I got hit with that a couple yeah, sessions ago. Yeah, I got ago. hit with that. I've hey, been hit with that. Only, last, I didn't, most people only lost one. Jesus Christ. I, no, I lost two. I lost yeah. three. So, so <laughs> just make two. that, because it's not, it's, not, uh, it's, it's not like permanent, permanent, but just make a note of it next year, wounds. <clears throat> So it doesn't do any extra damage this time, but it's just reduced your. We can't heal it. Not that we're going to get a chance to heal it. I mean, I am pretty, pretty much out now. No, if you're still standing, you're still fighting. I don't think I am still standing. I'm just trying to calculate the damage and soak now. That plus two, I think, just pushed me over the edge. Okay. The two. Uh, elf... 13 minus seven, so six. The two elf guards have no, been knocked two. out the way and they're on the floor. What? And Grader knocked them aside. Uh, She's just like a well, six foot six big boulder of metal as she comes steaming through. I need some bigger armour. Okay. <laughs> you and me both magic. I need runic armour or, or Rommel. <laughs> From to be fair, way. we need to survive. And then what happens? Yeah. Add it, okay. Let's add it to the list. Okay. So it's, it's through next? to... Um, I've lost my page. I do apologise for my lack of professionalism tonight. Um, Rolf hasn't rolled to hit, has he? Oh, yeah, oh he did, didn't he? No, he and hasn't I, rolled this time. Not this, not this round. round. Yeah. Johan goes first. Johan yes, goes. Johan first. Yeah. All right. I'm so there are shooting two roll. people on Hagen. There are... No, you can I'm probably get Rolf. a shot I, on Ingrader. I hate Rolf. I'm shooting Rolf. And I will okay. keep shooting Rolf. Wasn't like one of the guards now at the bottom of the initiative list because they dropped yep. weapon. One of the yes. two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Cool. The one attacking so you. One, one of them no, the one attacking on... Hagen. Yeah. The so one on more deck. There wasn't one on more deck. It was one on Hagen and one on me. That's yeah. right. Yeah. The one on Hagen is at the bottom of the initiative I'm... order. I'm going to re-roll. <laughs> Everybody's got the shit roll uh, pandemic tonight. And Jim's passed it on to us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Super spreader. Mission zero, mate. <laughs> <laughs> That's more like nice, it. Nice, nice. What? Okay, you shoot, you shoot uh, Rolf. <laughs> I have no idea how much damage that's going to do because the, the damaging yeah, effect. 14. For, uh, 14. <laughs> what I say? He's so stumbling around. So it can... Overtake yep. success levels. I think. It's a bit deep into his arm, and there's a lot of there's a lot of uh, blood coming out of his arm, and he is stumbling almost, but he's still with it. Bloody hell! As role playing people are. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it is his go. 
Um, so he's going to swing back at Hagen. Sort of figured as much. <clears throat> and he sort of semi guesses it's going to be. Well, he, he lets out a, a rather high pitch, but it comes together at the end. Uh, the Ebon Blade! <laughs> hey, uh. I'm uh, guessing he has one or two wounds left. Do we still have uh, the blessing, oh. Carolyn? Can I have a couple rounds? It was like activation. six rounds worth. Okay. Okay. So. Yep. Yep. Probably one for one or two more rounds. I'm, I haven't been tracking it properly. Uh, Jim, I'll have used my move to holster my repeater pistol. Okay. That's that's a good roll. Right. He's done <gasps> it again. That's a better roll. He's done it again. Bloody hell. <laughs> I can't get anywhere near that. But... Just, no. not Just like last night, Hagen took my dreams and crushed them aside. <laughs> yeah. As opposed to earlier where Hogan rolled an 11 and he went, eh, powie. Yeah, that, that hurt. That hurt my feelings. So, but I'm on four advantage now, so I'm feeling a little froggier. Oh, go on, my son. That's excellent. Okay, and in comes the guard as well on Hagen. Uh, the one on me, uh, I he's... believe. The one on Hagen's uh, uh, going so last the one on Carolyn, because yeah, of yeah. the fumble. Yeah. So, the one on you, Carolyn. Seriously, Ow. spending a reroll. Okay, spending one of my one of my Twitch rerolls. So, uh, uh, yeah, Carolyn wins because got the higher base. Yep, <clears throat> yep. just about you... holding this guy off. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, yeah. Hey, it's another advantage. It is another advantage. Until I, you know, fail to hit my, my next action, but you know. Carolyn! <laughs> I'm going to Kill, I'm man. going to fail to hit this guy. Well, you know. She's going to attempt believe, to brutally murder him, but we'll believe see. Believe in Ulrich. Oh she does. She just doesn't <laughs> believe in herself so much. <laughs> Ooh <laughs> on the other hand, I'll take what that. What did I say? Nice. <laughs> Which is just enough, as we said, to win on that. So, 11 damage. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, now they're screwed. <laughs> yeah, he dies in the pool of his own hands. Beautiful. From his, Absolutely uh, beautiful. Right yeah, I love that old yeah. boy. <laughs> <laughs> Bloody hell. Yeah. That was nice. If I could have scored that on Engrader. <laughs> yeah. Admittedly, she would have just taken it on the armour, but and, and fair enough. But... Uh, Okay. Four bleeding conditions. That is... So, more deck. Right. Let's do this. Um, so, is she still near me to, to hit, or she's, did she move? You, you, could probably off, so... you could probably run after her again and uh, engage her again. No, who's the closest one to me at the moment? So, you've got two elven warriors who have been knocked yes. over in front of you, or there's Rolf and the guardsman on Hagen. The other one's Hagen. showering blood everywhere. You get yeah, plus 20 to hit elves if they're on the floor. <laughs> Not just also, elves in general. <laughs> also, what you've noticed is that Thomas has got himself back up now and he's clutching his stomach, but he's staggering for the doorway. Kill him. He's bleeding to death. <laughs> yeah, I hit him. <laughs> I feel like he should get an advantage for hitting like a wounded man, but also disadvantage for being dishonourable. I mean, I put a fist-sized hole through him, so <laughs> he's got to die at some point. Yeah, and then he turns into a raging death beast that we probably can't kill. <laughs> or maybe can't kill. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, man. All right, you've got a re-roll, haven't you? Yeah, yeah he's I've got one. got one more re-roll left. You so might want to spend it. By the grace of all the gods. <laughs> I know. Come on. <laughs> oh, you didn't fumble. You didn't he can fumble. do worse. He can... can he even defend himself? He's clutching his stomach and trying to walk He's going to dodge, but he's not going to defend himself, but he's going to dodge whilst clutching his stomach, which isn't going to be very good. He gets to Thomas, make it. Thomas, Thomas. <sighs> I mean, he's got a percentage will. chance of death every turn, so I'm hoping he's going to It's leaking out. Oh. <gasps> 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 
You managed to dodge. Okay. That's all right. You swing in your Somehow axe. Somehow the guy who is staggering out the door while bleeding to death was probably, gains an advantage. It was staggering. It was his staggering. It's a staggering. Well, I think maybe the ancestors are trying to tell me something here. and Maybe maybe I should be going for someone else. Yeah, that was a very dishonourable strike. <laughs> um, okay. The right, axe told so me it's to... the guard on Hagen. Yeah. And we've got ultimate faith in because he's got a massive 33... Uh, should, he should. It should be a hard fight for Hagen here. Hard, <laughs> hard, hard weapon exchange. Don't don't take the Mick, Aaron. <laughs> That's when it all goes to pot. He rolls up and you roll a hundred. Yeah. Yeah. I've got three. I've got a re-roll. So, but yes, yeah, you're right. See, I do it back I'm back. not even fighting to these goons' uh, uh, strengths neither because they're actually better with their pistols that they've got. But no, we're going for it. Oh, crap. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that is an attack that would have ended me. Fantastic. <laughs> that is just fantastic. Just <laughs> so it's only 22 damage. No, no. Well, no I was, that was defending. A defense. Oh, you were yeah. defending. Yeah, yeah. Do, do I not still win that one, though? No, I got plus 12, and you got plus 5. <laughs> I I'm, but well. I have I have capped out my advantage, so... Uh, I'm uh, telling you he's a tank. This guy is a tank. Well, he's a glass can, is what he is. Okay. Okay, and it's back to the top. Do, 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 do. Okay, so... This elven woman who you've just swung at backs off, and there is um, a like a coach and horses, uh, but uh, on on the front of them there's six big, beautiful, beastly horses. Yeah, and they're black. Uh, and in villainous style, the the cab. Is also painted in a red. Yeah. Um, you thought I was going to say black there, didn't you? Uh, <laughs> yeah. Um, and there are a couple more elven guards around the coach doorway that is open, but they're just stood there with their shields out. She. I've never though, seen so many elves in one place. <laughs> she, though, stands her ground and she lets off a shot. You get a the opportunity, right, Dan? I was going to say, she's uh, in combat. She can't shoot her by you. She disengaged? Does she have advantage to do that? Oh, yeah, because no, she, she got damage. She, no, she, she, she took a she hit, got hit So she didn't have any advantage to disengage. Uh, she, no, she, 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 didn't, she didn't actually get hit, she but, get she hit. Got a, but it did take her advantage. So she's, she's not doing that. Yeah, You're right, she did get hit. Um, okay. She is going to try. In fact, she stops and she draws her hand weapon. Oh, nice. Not nice. I'm currently surrounded by like four very, of them. It's a very nice sort of katana shape. Come on, sword. you're a sword master. You're master I'm a duelist. diplomat. <laughs> you're a master I'm a duelist. diplomat. <laughs> you can do it. Two, the power two, of tiny, two tiny runes actually glow as she pulls it from its scabbard. <laughs> Lovely. Great. So I've been and it, it stabbed shines, by one magical weapon, it, and I'm going to get stabbed by another magical weapon. Darkness. Okay, so she has done that. Elmarin. <laughs> Elmarin is literally in the fight of his life. He's got Ingrader attacking him, and someone else attacking him. Um, cool. Um, I guess I'll hit Ingrader because she's like actually stabbing me at this moment in time. Okay. Cool. I mean, I'm not combat efficient. Enough to it's... win a fight with her, but we'll see what she does. I'm hoping you roll badly. Cuts. Is that including your advantage that you got for hitting? I don't have thingy? no because I lost it, didn't I? Because Ingrader smacked me. Oh, was that after? Yeah, it was after. <laughs> Ingrader cannot beat an elf on initiative. 
but she probably can beat me in combat. <sighs> yeah, uh, just a bit. Yeah, I'm done for. <clears throat> I'm not even going to bother rerolling because I can't beat it. Is that it? Is that the one? No, no. Was, that was, no, no, that that was, was her defense. Was oh, that was her defense. Oh, yeah, but so... I've got. I can't. I'm not rerolling it because I can't physically beat it. Get past that. Unless no. you roll an eleven. Even if I roll an eleven, I don't beat it. Well, you'd still critter. Yeah, but I wouldn't beat it, so it would be a waste of a roll for a one in oh, one hundred no, no, chance. Okay. So down the list we go. It Hagen. is Hagen. Hagen, uh, looking straight at Rolf, swings, hammers out, back around, and tries just, to no, finally... Just, no, this is going to knock his hand off, don't you? <laughs> God, I hope so. <laughs> I really hope so. Last round of the blessing. Yes. Please, please. How does he do it? On a plus eight. Oh, it's yeah. it's well, because a... he's spent... A staggering amount of experience over yeah. overspending, I'm pretty sure, weapon skill and two hand oh, yeah, yeah. over what he and needs for that is career. awesome, man. That's and awesome. I've got I mean I've got five advantage and plus also ten plus from... five advantage, also plus ten. So he's on plus it's, sixty on top of it's yep. awesome. Let's see how Rolf does. I might have to re-roll. Um, That's actually sorry. not a great roll. <laughs> but... He can he can actually successfully defend that, we have seen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh. Oh Damn. Man. Ooh. Water. Well, I'll take I'll I'll take, take the, on the crit on me. the armor, yeah. But Badly jarred on. That sounds like fun. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I'll take that on. I'll take that on the armor. That was arm. Okay, but I did still succeed. Uh, so it's 19. nineteen points of damage. Nineteen points of. Where did you? Okay, you you bring Amazite up and hit him underneath his ribs. And there's a loud sort of uh, creasing of metal and breaking of bones as you basically compress his uh, his breastplate up into his body. Blood shoots out from his mouth along with a few teeth. And he stares at you and squeals. <laughs> and falls backwards. Does that mean he's dead? Well, he doesn't look very good. <laughs> does that mean Aaron gets to attack again? Yeah, that definitely. Aaron, oh, that's that right. Step in and attack. Yes, that's right. I'll step. Kill in the guard. Hit, I hit the guard who was uh, hitting me. <clears throat> I think that's fair. Yeah. All right. Your mind's distraction has worked. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think that might just. Take his leg off. <laughs> uh, I'm even going to roll at that one. Yeah, <laughs> a bleeding condition falls yeah, over. No. Twenty-six damage. Plus two additional. You sort wounds. of bring Hammers like back down and in a, a, a sort of one-armed sort of strike to a blow behind you. Is this bloke's going to about to hit you in in the back of the head with the his halberd, and it just literally takes the the leg from underneath him and it doesn't rip it from its body but it might as well do as all the bones go with it and crack and crumble and he too lets out a bit of a um a deathly squeal shall we say are, are there any more of them within melee range of oh, there are them, right? there are two elves by the door and there is also thomas who is now at the doorway by the elves but are, are they already are, uh, are, are they, they two in melee range, within melee range of me? No. Okay. Yeah. No. But there was the other halberdier, right? Yeah. The, I was just uh, no, saying, he's no, dead, isn't wasn't. he? I cut that one down. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. that's right. That's right. Yeah. No. Okay. Yep. Let, let's, I, let's go I, back I to the shower of blood that uh, that uh, Carolyn did to him. Yeah, that's true. Back. She yeah. cannot forget that. That was Four a beautiful. It was a thing of beauty. I'm happy with that. Almost as much as the wizard dealt himself. I mean, not really, okay. but satisfying. <laughs> okay, so Hagen, ah, in greater. A bum bum, or shall we call a Griselda now? No, 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 no. This, is, this is the end for okay. me, I'm afraid, chaps. <laughs> if she even connects with me, I'm dead. If she cuts at you. 
I mean, that might not be dead, dead. It's it's not wounds, it's not necessarily. It's still critical. Dead. Yeah. It is, however, messy. I believe in your ability to roll a one. Me too. Oh, oh, it was close. Can I spend a fortune point to get it, an extra success? It will reduce the damage by one, but she'll still win. Why would she still win? Surely because my dodge skill. <clears throat> no, when it's equal, it's whoever's got the higher base, and 110 is higher than 65. Oh, she's got 110 base. Yeah. Okay, well, I've got no choice but to try and re-roll this, because if I, if I um, get... If you spend it... The re to to succeed it, on the it, re-roll, you're gonna need to get Colin, if I get hit, I'm dead. If, if I get hit, I'm dead. That's dead, a dead, dead or down. Therapy. Dead or down. I, I think I'm dead. The, the amount of damage he's doing right now, I think, does you would take, way below my spend a fortune point, you would uh, take ten to... damage. Yeah. Um, ten which damage. puts me which puts me. How many wounds have you got? I'm, one. Oh. Yeah. I, I'm go below my starting <laughs> wounds, so I've got no choice but to try and get through this. Okay. So, I, we go. I don't know the mechanics of this as well. I, I, there you go. I'm dead. <laughs> uh, no, Unless it's you're spending... Now. Have you got a fate point? I do indeed have a fate point. You can burn you the fate, fate point for it to miss. What, to or actually just the blow, the blow to miss? Well, you can either have it miss or you or can die another burn day. one and or... somehow survive the encounter. Oh, I didn't. I did. I, I did not know I could do that. I'll spend a fate point to make it miss. Okay, so that's permanent. So you've now got one yeah, fate yeah. and fortune. Yeah, I wouldn't have rerolled it if I don't know I could make a miss it. Oh, but there we go. Anyway, there we go. I've oh, made you a might miss. As it. Well, spend, spend the, fate. the fate. Spend the fortune point before you lose it by spending the fate are, point. Are you Are you going to just make this miss, or are you going to make it yourself safe for the rest of the encounter? No, I'm going to make it miss. Are you sure? Yeah. I also miscalculated. I've actually got five wins left. <laughs> oh, then left. no, you're still then up. Don't use it then. Don't use it. Because you, you've got... No, because with, with, with the minus two, with the re-roll, that, that's, that I do then drop. Yeah, if if you hadn't have re-rolled, you'd yeah, have only that, been taking that, 11 that, damage and you've that got was, a yeah, soak but, of seven. But if, if, if things get worse and it looks grim, you can then, I'm going to allow you to spend your fate point then. Okay, and then that something else will happen like you'll basically jump out of the way and hit your head on the rock. Yeah, but because I did the out. because I did the re-roll, I then I will then it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I'm not, not <laughs> Okay. I'm right. not taking a piss. <laughs> I don't mind because I, I decided to re-roll. I made that decision. Okay, right. In which case I don't do the re-roll and I take the damage and I'm down to one wound now. Okay. Oh, I feel like my heart is in my throat. <laughs> Okay. I think we need to all charge Griselda. I, I was about to go into a flying rage if the elf dropped. I've I, I got your back, man. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I did this so that you guys wouldn't be shot. <laughs> okay. I know. So, um... Got to respect the ballsiness of your move, even if... Uh, <laughs> even if it wasn't now... what might be called wise. <laughs> Thomas is at the door now with the two elves behind I go behind before him. Thomas. Say again. I thought I went before him. Ah, so well, you're going to have you go anyway. But I well, just want you to wait, wait. So he was at the door anyway. But, so you'd be able to shoot him any, anyway. All right. Um, I step forward, drawing my pistol, and shoot okay. him. Okay. Okay. In the face. I hope. Drawing your secondary black powder weapon. Yeah, that's my one-shot black powder weapon. On the other hand. Nice. Yeah, I mean, it, yeah. He sort of turns back to see what's going on. You, um, you hit him uh, below his head at the top. Uh, of his I'm going to use a fortune point as well. Okay. Oh, he's going to be dead. I mean, I don't care. I really want him to be dead. <laughs> Twenty damage he's, and ignoring some armor, and yeah. it's the one that's already he's, limping. His innards explode out of his back, and he just flops down. <gasps> oh, you got the elves covered in blood. Shame. <laughs> Okay. Uh, right. Um, more. No, Carolyn. Um, nothing near me's up, so I'm going to try and keep those elves from getting up and shooting. Hold on a second. I, I, I forgot can. something. The elves move. So oh, yeah, the good. two, yeah. 
the two hours by the stagecoach door have now moved up to towards the doorway. Uh, and the other two are inside, just inside the doorway. They're standing uh, solid, um, picking themselves up. Yeah, well, they're, they're, yeah, they're, they're not oh, very impressed. The but it's just been sprayed all over them. Um, yeah. Okay. Uh, if that's, that's all, it. Yeah. Okay. Cool. I'm going to be charging into the elves by the door. Okay. Can I get a charge, or is it just a move up and attack? Say again. Can it's I just a move up and attack. Okay, fine. Yeah. I am going to wall up an elf. Or Elmar. Or not. Oh. <laughs> to be fair. Uh, he might do worse. Oh, actually, yeah. See how I'll see how they do before I decide to re-roll it. I've got plenty of uh, fortune points. Uh, where are we? Uh, 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 uh. I'll take a wee vault. Wow. Yeah. Jesus, you rolled another one. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> okay. That's my advantage gone. It parries you away. Mordek. I'm going to follow up with Carolyn and attack an elf. Okay. If you attack the same one, you get plus 20. Do I? Outnumbering. Then Unless I will. Unless they have Combat Master, then you don't. Uh, I mean, you might as well. <laughs> yeah, why not? Try and take as many of the bastards with us as we can. Sure, well, thanks. Okay. Need to roll again, yeah. If the first one hits, the second one is going to be painful. Yeah. It does hit because he's equaled. And yeah. Dan's got the higher base. Just hit, and then the second one hits hard. So the first That's one hits for nine. eight damage. Nine because the axe has a bonus plus one. Yep. The first oh, yeah. and then the one. second one hit. So four. first one's nine, did you say? Yeah. Yeah. So the second one's eight success level, so twelve plus whatever Dan's strength bonus is. Second okay. one is, well, it's that plus the. My strength is forty. So it's fourteen. So 12, I think 16. it works out as fourteen, including the defense. And still, he's still up just. <sighs> well. <sighs> At least someone got a walloping. And you gained an advantage. Oh, and thank you, you very and much. And you've removed the advantage I just gave him. <laughs> um, <laughs> no okay, it's back to the top. Okay. Pardon me for one sec. It's fine. Oh, you've got Marin. most of it. You've got a while. <laughs> oh, okay. Marin, you can do it. We believe in you. Despite all the extra points I put in Dodge, I've not managed to dodge. The into the coach and shuts the door. She runs away. Oh, sorry, no. She leaves leaves the door open. Okay. Did do I not get to attack her before she runs away? No. Because oh. you're you're the, the fight's now you and in Grader. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm getting yeah. eating the crap out of at the moment. Yeah. Um, uh. It's now your goat, Morin. I mean, I'll kill her. I'll, I'll swing at her, but I don't think I'm, I'm gonna have much luck. My dice have been so bad. <laughs> a lot of us have been getting shit rolls. And Jim's got multiple ones. So, <laughs> I mean, he was due, right? Yeah, oh, to be fair, yeah. Jim has had some atrocious luck with previous encounters. And not, yeah, so much the, not so much this one. Not so much this one. I don't know. We're we're still on our feet, so I think we're, we're on, on our feet, feet because <laughs> Jim because because Jim chose for the NPCs to run away. <laughs> So she she parries that. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. I saw the plus eight I... <laughs> with, yeah. with contemptuous um, ease. Okay. Uh, rocks down to Hagen. Hagen uh, runs up and swings at Ingrader. Oh, so he's yes. backing up and behind. behind, and you get plus twenty. You've got to go through the elves first. 
You've yeah, there's an elf in the way. The elves. There, are yeah, two, uh, there were two elves, elves in the way. In the Just hit the elves. The uh, I, I, hit the wounded elf, get plus 40, and then death blow into Ingrader. <laughs> no, okay. there's two elves behind him, don't forget. Yeah, but if he kills one, he can step up and then hit her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, I'll do that. I'll hit the wounded guy. <laughs> That's what heroes do. Oh, 14. <laughs> do <I don't> <laughs> I really don't need to uh, bother rolling. So I was going to roll that then, but it's, that's not Big enough. damn heroes. <laughs> what just be big damn heroes? Well, to be fair, uh, wearing someone down is not anti heroic. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I, uh, I'll use my armor. On my right arm to uh, negate that critical. But your my armor is taking a beating. <laughs> yep. But better your armor than your tendons. Oh, yeah. 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 No, it's definitely the uh, right way to go. Okay. So, uh, did that kill him? Um, yes. Well, I step through. Did him twenty-eight and swing damage health. kill him? I mean. Okay, there is there is another half elf, another elf in the way who is more um, Hagen what? fodder. Could okay. he not step into where that elf was and then hit Ingrader? No, because there's two behind. Basically, they were in, they were in the front of the doorway. The others are okay. two come to into uh, the yeah, doorway. Yeah, but he takes behind. that elf's yeah. position. There are two more elves yeah, behind exactly. the elves he, yeah, we, were, we were so, fighting. Yeah. You've got the there two, were, there were, two elves that were inside the inn, and the two elves have come from oh. the coach. The yep, door. Yep. I see. Basically, a battle line between Hagen and uh, yeah. Zelda. So what, yeah, so I move in and swing at the the elf that was uh, you know that's uh, blocking my next way in the lane. Yep. Not a great roll, but <laughs> not a, not a, not a spectacular roll, but twenty four damage plus nine success levels. I mean, Jesus! Let's see if I get any success levels at all. Dad, oh, oh fucking hell! How many? Uh, yeah, all right. That's uh... another point of armor. <laughs> Yep, That'll that's the armor off the left leg. Okay. <laughs> Bloody hell, how many quits are you going to roll tonight, Jim? <laughs> God. Uh, but I still do 23 points of damage to this elf. Minus yeah, his he, get, he gets flattened. Okay, then can I move in and, and strike, strike it in greater? Uh, I think I there believe. are two more elves. Uh, you no, know, because no, no, he kills it, steps in, in kills yeah. it, steps there is, in. There is a bit of a gap here between Ingrader and the doorway though. So it's not like an immediate line of attack. Okay. Okay. Is, is, is one of the el other elves adjacent to me then? The yeah, absolutely. The yeah. Yeah. Right. Smash another elf. <laughs> I'll swing Mord away. Mordek's just looking and is very proud of you right now. I think. <laughs> dead elf. Dead elf. Dead elf. Dead elf. Plus, plus 13 <laughs> SL. Okay. Well. Bloody hell. You are, you of course, if it gets, keeps getting criticals on me, my armor is going to fall off my body. <laughs> uh, these elves are definitely doing their, their damn best, their, their level best to, to um, keep you at bay. But, uh, yeah, 31. Well. 31. Two, then three. I swing at the, swing at the last the elf. Leg. I think you probably removed that leg. So I, I, I swing around, Hammerzite comes around towards the fourth and final elf. <laughs> <laughs> Plus Another 10 leg. SL. How many of these elves have like have, have you removed a leg from in this in this single round of combat? He's just killed four elves in a row. Yeah, I'm just curious where he's killed them. So he's done oh, 26. 26. <laughs> yeah, they're done as well. <laughs> and we were worried. We were worried about this combat. I mean, I'm about to die. <laughs> yeah. Hagen is a, Hagen's one hit away from death too, and and the only reason we're alive is because the archer chick left. <laughs> but, yeah, basically. <laughs> yes, you're welcome. Okay. We're, we're alive also because Ingrader's leaving. The, those of us who aren't getting savaged by Ingrader. <laughs> she's now trapped by a wall of angry Hagen and corpse. 
And Warren's like, come at me, bro. <laughs> so in grade art, we'll swing at El Marin. It was nice knowing you. <laughs> Although you do still have that fate point. Yep. Where are you? She's right. going to roll badly, I believe, guys. She's yeah, going to finally roll badly. Believe. Believe um, that she is capable believe. of fumbling. And I'm going to dance around it like a pretty princess. <laughs> Oh, for crying out loud. To be fair, for her, given all the advantage she's probably accrued by now, that is a yes! Oh, go on, my son! <laughs> well done. Finally! <laughs> nice! Well, Mara dances! <laughs> That's good, because it's now cost her all her uh, advantage. Advantage, yep. <laughs> okay. And we're we're going to be outnumbering her next round, so... <laughs> You mean uh, next so. round? Yeah, we're going to wait on that. Who's next? It's Johan. Uh, well, guns are out. Swords okay. out. It's time. I'm going to, I'm charging in greater. Okay. I don't think I've ever seen Johan wield a sword. <laughs> We've never been in a fight. I don't think that's Johan's lasted ever long seen enough. Johan wield a sword. <laughs> we have never been in a fight that has lasted long enough. Quite However, a lot of our fights have ended before I've taken an action. Between advantage and outnumbering, I might actually do all right. Nice. Oh. Nice, nice. We're head out. Ooh, well. Oh, I actually still win. Point yep. one. <laughs> one oh, point nice. of damage. <laughs> okay. Were you outside the when thingy hit? Okay, so there is a glass bowl thing again. And on it comes down and there's a crack. On grader. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yeah, she was the one with the magical shield. No, no, she's no, 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 she was. Was. Now she's got a magical no, she's shield. Oh, right. Okay. Sorry, my mistake. So the elf cast it on her or something. Okay. I presume so. Um, I'm trying, Ilmarin. <laughs> Ilmarin's thankful for the help. Who's up uh, next? Uh, <laughs> all the elves? Uh, nope. They're all um, dead days. <laughs> it is Carolyn. What? Go on, Carolyn. Go on, Carolyn. Join the party. If I can get in there, I will charge with my one hit, one wound left. I will charge. In We're gonna do it. This is where she like does this massive sweep blow and just beheads all of us at once. <laughs> yeah, hey, you, yeah, yeah. She is gonna death get, blow for us. You get plus forty now because we are outnumbering a three to one. <laughs> okay. Well, I will attempt to hit her. I have no advantages. I have plus forty due to um, outnumbering. Bring it. Oh, and she oh, fires. Yes, <laughs> and that doesn't 16. take into uh, eighteen. Oh, because that's 18. not taking into account my uh, my strike my for uh, some reason. It stopped uh, taking uh, into account. It's all right, more deck. How much, the party how much next. damage is that? Eighteen. Eighteen. Might yeah, be more than uh, one past armor if it connects with her okay. at all. Depends if it goes through this bubble thing. Yeah. Advantage. Yes. Better. Okay. She staggers back. Uh, more deck. Um, I'm going to join the fray. Okay. Uh, squeeze myself in here. <laughs> um, how many am I on? Uh, it's just plus 40. It's just plus 40. <laughs> you can't go above plus 40. <laughs> okay. uh, it was worth a shot. On top, plus the advantage you got from whacking that elf earlier. Yes, yeah, so I've got two. Well, all I've got to say is that I better hit after that amazing <laughs> set. Oh, fantastic. There we nice. go. <laughs> nice. She reduces it by four, but you've got plus one for your... So 15 damage. So 15. And, and the other 42 one. Is I should have left. I should have left the Elven Bowman in there, shouldn't eight. I? Uh, so that hits as well. So that's a... What was it? 15 and a... 12. 12, yeah. 15 and a 12, 15 and a 12 yeah? yeah? Yeah. Yeah. 
<laughs> oh, he's got it there. Fantastic. <laughs> okay. Hagen, just smash the coach. The way you're hitting it will work. <laughs> the coach okay, all, all has yet to, do is, to move away. The coach all you have to do is bust one on the wheel. Away. Or smash the, yeah, the wheel or the horse. No, if, the, if, if you, you, just you just hit, hit the a horse, the horses will spook and run. If you smash a wheel, it can't go anywhere. I suspect the, the horses it will still drag it. But it won't go very well anywhere fast. No, It'll... but they were weren't they weird magical horses? Like in the fact that they looked quite. Who knows? No, they were just beautifully monstrous kind of uh, thing. Who knows? They okay, might. Be... But six the... horses oh, can drag that thing. Yeah, back to oh, yeah totally. oh. Do I have to? Yeah, keep stabbing in, Grady. Keep stabbing her. You can do I've it. I've got plus you, forty though. Haven't you now I get plus yeah. forty because everyone is wailing. And you and you successfully did it last time. Didn't you? Yeah, I did. I've, I've got one advantage. Nice. I'll let her. Defend herself. She oh, is... I've been forgetting I get a defense point from my sword. So my soak is actually eight. Oh, so I should have a few more wins left. Sort it out later. I do actually oh! hit her. Yeah. Just hit. Yes. Nine, uh, so that's one point of damage. Cool, I'll take it. Oh, yeah. She's still up. I'm sure she is. Hagen moves Hagen. in. Hagen moves Coach in. Go for the elder oh, yeah. woman. No, I'm going. I I don't think I'm going to be able to stop that coach, but I want to make sure she dies before she kills Ilmarin. Uh, Ilmarin's feeling yeah. a bit more confident now. He's got his advantage back. <laughs> now, and that, whatnot. now that you're not out, now, now that you're, yeah. you know, she is significantly outnumbered. Oh, blimey. Bloody hell. <sighs> 16 success levels. It makes me so upset when I see my damage. I'm just like, oh my god. <laughs> it's because you <laughs> haven't been spending everything. Also, he's got. Yeah. Um, Actually, no, that doesn't actually matter. You've got okay, success so it's, You've not been spending everything you have on being it's, more it's dangerous. It's only 24 life. damage. 24 oh, damage. No. <laughs> uh, unless Hagen spends a fortune and makes it 25. No, I'll, I'll leave it at 24. Okay. She... Hold on a second. She's going to... Uh, Hold on a second, just give me two minutes. Sorry to be... Everybody take a drink or something quickly. Sorry. <laughs> Are we still live, I assume? I think no, so. no, Colin's gone. <laughs> Colin's gone, so he did tell us so we might so be still be live. And, and, and to be honest, I think if Hagen had gone after that coach, that elf archer would just kill him because yeah. he's got yeah, no way to, right. he's yeah, got yeah, no yeah. way to defend against it in, in all archer. honesty i thought i was sacrificing ilmarin when i dived into combat with all those archers because i just figured if they start pinging shots off at us we didn't stand a chance yep yep so i was just like i've got to close the gap and then when she could still shoot i was like i've got to do something to try and stop her from shooting yeah because those magical arrows were hurting mm -hmm. I, I spent all that time building up my toughness so i had extra wounds and i've just lost them all <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah. That, those, 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 those hits that you, me, and Mordek have taken. Yeah. I was up to Nasty. sixteen wounds. I was so proud of myself. I was actually a tough elf for a change, and then uh, yeah, now I'm down to twelve. I also totally forgot that my magical sword gives me plus one defense on all my air points. So I've put my wounds back up. So I'm actually on four wounds now. Okay. Oh. She steps back from the the blow. And she spends a point of something. Of oh, fate? <laughs> and it misses her. Oh. God damn it. All right. Go here, Han. Oh, no, it might be her next, actually. So, let's... Um... Okay. Hagen in greater. Huh? So she, there's about four people on top of her at the moment, aren't there? Uh, yep. Five. Five. Yeah. Okay. Well, literally the entire party. The entire standing party up. is standing around her attacking. Um, roll me a D5, please. Someone. Which one of us is she going to kill? Oh. Okay. Five. Sorry, it did it. More deck. 
I thought we said we were going to let Rod roll these things anymore. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, it, it kind of doesn't matter who she attacks. If she lands the blow, we're going down. <laughs> yeah, but I, I don't mind taking the blow at this point because I've got my two advantage and I've got my dodge skill. It's now it will be 85, so I should stand a good chance. Oh, oh. She rolled a 98. Go on, Mordek. You don't get your plus 40 on the defensive. <sighs> but he has got two advantage, doesn't he? I do, yeah. Yes. He does get his Have advantage. I got a re-roll at all? No. Nope. no. <laughs> I didn't even look. No. I've been keeping an eye on it. Twitch have blown their load. There's no more. <laughs> <laughs> I never thought I'd see her fail a all. I mean, yeah, it was due to overwhelming advice. Hold on, you know. wait until more day. Yeah, I was going to say more day's but, but, No, I, I never thought I'd see her get negative success levels, is what I mean. We've been landing oh, yeah. blows. But, but. Yes. yes. You carry it away. So you gain another advantage, more day. Oh, thank you. <clears throat> so my foundry just decides for it to go really slowly. Okay, Hagen. Uh, Johan, I think, right? It's not me. Hagen's just gone. Sorry, yeah, yeah, yeah. My mistake. Johan. Okay. <laughs> now you're scraping the barrel when you're trying to fly on me to do something in melee. <laughs> go on. <laughs> 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 you, say well, you, say that. That. you say that. Well, with five advantage and outnumbering five to one, I might. <laughs> we're not scraping the bottom of the babble. We're oh, pressing Lord. our advantage. So, 13 damage. Uh, I'm going to use a fortune point to add another one. 14, 14 damage, damage, yeah. Uh, 16. Okay, she's still up. Um, the chariot, the cart, begins to move away. Um, okay. I'm figuring there's no way of me stopping it, so if I'm up next... Um, it is something Aaron. between the spokes of the wheel. Um, I'm going with killing this traitorous bitch okay. and, and <laughs> screaming something along those lines at her while... I do so. <clears throat> Nineteen. That's a six. Nice. Well, that was brutal. Good Nineteen, damage. Head, too. 19 plus... damage to the head. Is that including the plus forty? Yes. Oh, okay. My skill is not that great, and I only have one advantage at the moment. Ah, okay. Because I failed to hit the guard coming in. Eighty four. <laughs> so fourteen damage. So nineteen no, because yeah. I've got plus two okay. for that. So sixteen damage to the face. Okay. Yeah, you, you you strike her across the face with your axe and it knocks her helmet from her and it cuts her quite it takes her eye out as you, you sort of it and she sort of gargles a bit and falls forward face down into the mud. Um Job Carolyn. Nice killing blow I was not expecting to get. <laughs> Mordek. Well if she's down, um Time to do the Mordek special. Do what's the do to the wheel what you did to the door. <laughs> charge the carriage. Can I charge that will I realistically get to the carriage, Jim? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, don't forget they're quite slow to move. Then I will charge the carriage and basically try and jump on it. <laughs> no, smash the wheel. You've got your weight. Those things are huge. Yeah. Nah, it's just a wooden okay. wheel. I saw you go for a solid oak door. Out with an axe. <laughs> Are you going to jump on it? Yeah, I'm going to try and jump on it. Yeah. Okay. I think that's, roll, that looks more cool. <laughs> roll me an athletics roll. Or a, this is a, where it all falls where he just falls flat in his face. If in you the mud. fumble, if you fumble, all you're going to wheels. fall underneath the wheels. Ah, <laughs> <gasps> <gasps> uh, that's fine. That's what fate points are for. <laughs> he gets uh, run over by a horse. <laughs> you run over by a cat. It will survive the fight and get trampled into the dust by them. Oh, that's dear. Horses. That, that, that's, that's just not a good way for a dwarf to go. <gasps> Success. <laughs> you leap onto the back and you pull yourself up on where the luggage goes. Oh, fantastic! <laughs> Now what do I do? I'm having my Indiana Jones moment. <laughs> to the top, Ilmarin. Ilmarin, and... seeing Mordek do this, follows him out. <laughs> I will also try to jump on board. Actually, Ilmarin's smarter than that. He's not going to do that. 
He's going to swing his sword around as he's running out and he's going to javelin it through the spokes of the wheels. Okay. So sh shall I just do a ballistic skill test? I'm assuming that's yes. what it would be. I get a success. Oh, oh. Uh, um, and what range is it, or what, what range are we saying? Are you just saying, I'm, saying I'm literally that... going out of the door and is getting. I'm, going, I'm trying to get as close as I can with a single move because obviously okay. I can move and then okay. do it right. So I'm getting as close as I can with a single move, and then because obviously I'm trying to throw a sword in some spokes. It's not okay. <laughs> perfect science. <laughs> I'm basically trying to make it like jolt and catch. Okay. I'm happy to re-roll it if it's not enough though. So it sticks into the cart. And there's like a shock wave, boom, boom, yeah, as you hit it, and sort of sick blackness comes out from it. It knocks you from the chariot, Mordek. Oh, oh, magic, a magic okay. carriage. Can someone roll me a d6, please? Oh, bollocks. <laughs> That's two points of damage each to you, pair, as <laughs> it's very cold. And very negative damage. And then my sword. You don't take any damage cow. from dropping or anything. It just gets. But did the sword go through the spokes? No, it's just stuck into the, the chariot itself. <laughs> so you've just lost your magic sword. So I have a very large magic sword on my back. Well, actually, it's no, not my back. I've left it behind. The, the sword has bounced to the floor as well. Oh, okay. it's been, cool. it's, so it's jammed in, got hit by a spoke and got knocked off. No, 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 no. It's basically, it's hit the back of the chariot. Oh, right. Um, we just lost more deck. Um, and as it hits, Finally whatever, yeah, whatever <laughs> I'm just about in got, frame. It, it's, it's just sort of crackled out with a sickening black thing. It, the, the people who aren't in combat with it, i.e., Mordek and Elmarin, you still feel slightly queasy as this energy of negative death comes out from romantic powers. Yeah. Mm. It's it's like she works for a necromancer or something. And it is carrying on moving. Uh, how fast is this thing moving now? And how far away from us is it? Um... So it's moving at a fair speed. You'd probably be able to catch up with it if you sprinted at it, but not for very much longer. And if you hadn't got arm, full armour on. So if you got full plate mail on, you'd probably be able to just about catch up with it, but like for a swing or two. You're not going to do any damage to it. We've Is the coffin still in here with us in the bar? The coffin's still in the uh, pub. So we've achieved our goal. Hopefully, we haven't checked the coffin, but but the, the, in, in the character's mind, they would assume the coffin the coffin's full, right? I don't know. Oh, well, We're letting we some enemies get away if we let her get away, but Cavalin is not chasing after away. this. Cavalin is not even going to try and chase after this carriage. So I'm not. I'm I'm, I'm just raising the, the the I'm making the statement rather than making any kind of suggestion. Yeah, I mean. I doubt, uh, looking at the coffin... Can I use a fortune point to act before the carriage moves again? Oh, sure. So it's closer to me. Okay, I'm going to do that. Um, so I'm actually going to scoop up a weapon off the floor from one of the dead people. Yep. Hone it after it and try and literally jam it in between the spokes of the wheel. Basically how well. trying to do what... what... What Il Marwin just tried. Okie dokie. Having another go at it. Halberd's probably got a better uh, chance of doing something to in this in that way. Literally there. just a solid metal weapon to hand scoot as I Yeah, but I'm just thinking Halberd's probably going to be more likely to do something than a sword anyway. It's, it's just it is gonna be some it. pretty cool rolls needed. Oh yeah. Uh, where are we? Where are we? Where are we? Um. Okay. Right. Okay. So you can scoop up a weapon. I allow you to do that to throw it. No, I'm not throwing it. I'm running up and jamming it in. Okay. You're going to run up and jam it in. 
okay. Because I'm acting before it pulls away again. Because you said it was still in running distance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can still get it to running distance. Um, to actually get it in. Yeah, it's going to take a very hard roll at doing it. I'm guessing a melee roll. Yeah. And have you got a dub- uh, what, what sort of weapon are you trying to use to do it? Uh, thingy's two-handed sword. Have you got two-handed skill? Um, one of the elves' one-handed metal swords. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. All right. Have a go. Very hard. Uh, yeah. Two success levels. Okay. So it goes in. The wheel locks up at the back and is being dragged. So it's like <laughs> someone's pulled the brake on it. But the sword is bending. So Hagen, because I think I think it's actually Hagen's turn. He'll yeah. seeing uh, seeing his best friend uh, and the person he's supposed to be protecting run out there <laughs> and do this. He follows uh, and and swing. He follows Oops. and goes to the Hold other side. Hold a second. Side. Roll yourself a d six. Oh yeah, cold damage. Okay, four. and take four necromantic damage again. Ow. Is that all of us? Uh, no, just it's... You, you two have been... It, it, Johan has moved up to it, so just Johan. Okay, done. But it's still there and it's still locked in. in. But it looks like it's bending. So it's not going to be a permanent solution. All right. Hagen will run up, swing hammers up at the back wheel on the opposite side. Okay. Plus eight success levels. Okay. 23 damage. Now, if you've got much fortune left, you could pop another point on. Well, be careful because if we do stop this thing, that elven yep, woman's yep. going to get out and you might have to fire. Yep, yep. Okay. Imagine that's easy. So, Hagen, uh, someone roll a d6 again. Five. Oh, <laughs> guess what I'm going to say. Okay. You take that many points of damage through armor and everything, obviously. That this this damage is it's yeah. it's yeah um okay. and the you've basically not the back of the the back of the car sidewards and that wheel is sort of teetering in fact it, you've put a spoke through it's not teetering you've put a spoke through Uh, that's Johan. I guess. Um, Elmarin or Mordek or Kath- Carolyn? I'm on one wound. <laughs> and yeah. that thing's doing pulses of nasty looking magic. If I get near yeah. it, it's just going to kill Il- me. Elmarin, having taken just damage, realizes that uh, this is far beyond the skill of yeah. any of us. Yeah, Pol- after Hagen felt that freezing necromatic energy himself, he is also at one wound and probably will not be engaging the cat. Yeah, the Imarin, <laughs> Imarin calls for them all to back off. So Imarin just shouts out and goes, we've got the coffin. Let's secure it. <laughs> Carolyn, open it up if you're still in there and check this all in there. <laughs> yeah, I'll move back inside. Okay. Burn those and burn the body of uh, Ingrida and, yeah. and Rolf. Yeah, burn those Three bodies. Of those, all of the fuckers. She'll, so you'll she'll yell back. back. You all move back towards the tavern. Yeah, I'm should... asking this to. Yeah. Um, I'm reloading the pistol. Okay. <laughs> and yeah. I'm going to be walking alongside it, reloading. Walking alongside. Taking more necromantic well, damage. It's not pulsing unless it takes that. Well, I'm going to kind of mm. walk slightly further away from it. So okay. if it's moving forward, I'm kind of walking that way. Okay, everybody else moves back towards the tavern. There's some movement around outside the tavern, but it's mainly onlookers. Okay, there's people moved into the tavern to have a look around and see what's going on. 
I think Ilmarin and Mordek are probably dragging the bodies out, ready to burn them. Okay. Just going to burn them in the streets. Hagen, okay. as, as Hagen walks back into the pub, he pulls out his only healing draft and, and drinks it to give healing himself. Healing draft. Yeah, that would be a nice thing to have had. Um, oh, wait. I've got loads of those, haven't I? <laughs> well, a mixture. Some are, some are healing drafts and some are nothing. Yeah, yeah. You've got a mixture Please. of snake oil and healing draft. Yeah. Um, so. Actually, as Jim, you're following it, Jim, uh, if there are yeah. onlookers, and I noticed that there are onlookers, yeah. As I re as 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 things sort of collapse, I will make a point of calling out our victory to the White Wolf. Okay. Partly because it feels like the right thing to do, but also okay. partly because I really want to make a point to the <laughs> to anyone who might be. Uh, you notice actually which side that as. As sort of everything comes back to you and sort of everything outside your little box yeah. starts to affect you again. You notice that there seems to be a bit of a um, a bit of a victory going on with the other part of the force that was going in against the, the main. And I am there's a, there's slightly some... surprised given that they just walked into a trap that in greater set for them, but yeah. <laughs> but um... hey. Okay, you, you follow it for another, what, Six five seconds. minutes? seconds. A few seconds. Six seconds. You notice as it, as it starts to wobble more and more. My, my pistol only takes one round to reload because I'm very well trained in gunner. Okay. <laughs> the elf jumps from the the cart. <laughs> well, shit balls. <laughs> Are you going to blast her? Uh, I'm going to blast her and then... The words I'm looking for are tactically withdraw. <laughs> she looked out though. She's looking at you and she's got bow in hand. Shit balls. <laughs> <laughs> okay. In which case I'm gonna use my last You get fortune. the first shot. Um I'm <laughs> Or you can run for it. I'm at so I'm actually gonna run round the other side of the wagon so she can't shoot me because those arrows look painful. Okay. <laughs> So you're going to run around the other side. I'm yeah? going to heroically run away. So I've got a okay. big, big object. You can't her say I myself. didn't give you a chance for one last hurrah. Right. No, that's, okay, you run around the fine. other side. As you come back round again, she's nowhere to be seen. She's disappeared. Yeah. I'm assuming okay. she's not in the carriage anymore. Uh, no. And the carriage has basically toppled over. So with it dragging and that wheel being smashed by Hammerzeit. Um, or as known to all my NPCs as hammer shite. <laughs> um, <laughs> it's all right. I can claim to have stopped the carriage. Um, yeah. You it, stopped, stopped the carriage, but unfortunately the elf got away. Hey, I was on my own. Come on. <laughs> um, the rest of us aren't paying that much attention to what's going on down there. So, you, know, you, you could come back and tell us that unfortunately the, the, the elf got away. And you start chucking the bodies on there. Uh, of the Kessler family, who I think are all not dead now. Yeah, yeah, Wait, are, I believe yeah. we got them all. Yeah, no, one of them isn't one of them still a beastie. He's dead. <laughs> no, yeah, the one we the hammers like crushed outside the church turned into a beastie, didn't he? I yeah. think he's dead. Of some kind. Whether I mean he's, he's moving. <laughs> okay, he's technically the others, dead. The, the others didn't have chance to give it the full ritual uh, action before they started the fight with you. We did surprise them. I was yeah. honestly expecting them to be jumping back up again. Um, That's why we're burning them, right? Yes, yeah, you're burning the bodies. Uh, um, them. I'll Heretics. Stroll back, reloading my Sigma. other pistol. <laughs> okay. You know how much um, Ilmarin loves burning things anyway. Oh, yes. I am quite happy to, to, to assist Ilmarin with burning the traitor, traitor's corpses. Okay, and as everything sort of fades out and the, the bonfire's burning and it, there's a sort of foreshadow of you all looking at the fire and there's a little halfling playing the drums on the helmets of the Kesslers <laughs> and dum 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 and we shall call it there for the season as everybody gets 200 XP. How Ooh. did we survive that? Actually, no, I know um, the answer to that. You didn't press the attack. <laughs> but 
better. And indeed, we shall leave it there for season Thank two as we much, draw Jim. it to end. That and was... we shall, yeah, leave Thank that you. for until next oh, time. Just a minute, season just three. before we just before we go. Um, Dan is on his way back in, so we'll bring him back oh, in. Oh, we'll wait for Dan. We'll wait. Yeah. Uh, give me a moment because I'm going to need to rearrange. Jim, I just want to thank you for running such an amazing yes. campaign no again. I Pleasure, mean, right? just absolutely favorite game. 100%. Yeah, it has been brilliant. Game. Yeah, no, it's, it's only possible with good players, so thank you very much. Um, yeah, obviously you'll meet up with the... I'm here. Um, thank you very much. Uh, what, what's Sorry about this that. Place? Oh, Zulric and all his crew as well. And yeah, you, you'll get your experience points and... We'll probably do a bit of a story before the next season, whenever we do that. Okay. So thank you all very much. Thank you all for watching. Um, oh, please join us of... again if and when that happens. Um, I'm sure it will. Yeah, we're planning it for it too. Um, and we'll see you in the new year. Well, further into the new year. Um, I, th I believe it'll be around sort of March time. Uh, March, April time. Right. But yeah, thank you very much for each and I every I apologise for the state of the images, but whatever it'll do. <laughs> That's all right. My, my computer just managed to drag itself out before the end of the season, so it's done its job. Um, Mine didn't. <laughs> did yours die? Um, but yeah, thank you very much, everybody. Thank you very much to our viewers. You've been really loyal and really good. Uh, I hope you all enjoyed it. Uh, if you've got any ideas for season three, any of the viewers or... Well, we've um, got a couple of evil elves to go yeah, and hunt there's down still, and kill. Yeah, there's still a few I things. A, I believe there's, there's a, many of them now. a bit of a nerd list to go out. There's yeah. a couple of elves. Um, there's what Not I to mention uh, the Bretonian invasion of Uber's Reich. The Bretonian invasion yeah. of Uber's Reich. Maybe yeah. finding some way of healing these semi-permanent wounds we've all taken. Absolutely, that's so a good point. So we can point. actually... You know, stand up in a fight and not just. I mean, by, by all means, when you've spent your, hit, uh, your experience points, please write down and let me know what you'd like to do to to sort of close, not close off, but to do next as your character. So, for instance, find a way in sorting out these wounds, blah blah blah. Get change career path or whatever. Um, you know, you want to become yeah. a swordmaster. Or duelist. Well, what I intend to do as well uh, <laughs> at some point on probably the World Builder channel on uh, Discord. Ooh, I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm buying. <laughs> In vogue. <Yeah. laughs> Oof. Uh, is I'm going to put it out there to a few of the, the viewers and whatever to see if we can build a bit of a, a town up with a few quirks and things in the Warhammer. Thing oh, is, see right. if anybody's got any sort of ideas. We'll either open a separate channel or that or whatever. But we'll we'll probably load that into it as well. But yeah, what what you'd like to do next? Uh, personal characters and uh, if there's anything in particular, any any people that you've met along the way that have annoyed you, and um, you'd like to sort them out. I'm sure there's a one or two or three. Um, but yeah. Um, but yeah, uh, as a, again, again, thank you very much for joining us. Much appreciated, and we'll see you further on in the new year, hopefully. Goodbye. Till then. You. Cheers. Cheers. Well. Nice.